Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're probably wondering, does your GPA actually matter? And you're probably actually really doing bad in school right now, which is why you clicked on this video because you're like, does failing that test mean I have no job in the future? So, if you're you, I'd stop watching and go do your homework. No, 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 don't worry, I'm just kidding. Hey guys, my name's Adam. Welcome back to another episode of Adam Finance. So, since you found this video, you're probably wondering, does my GPA actually matter as an engineering major? Well, the short answer is, it's complicated. Let me give you a good list of reasons why your GPA does matter and why your GPA does not matter. I'm someone who has had various internships uh, ranging from mechanical engineering to now I will have my first industrial engineering internship. So I've definitely been through the application process and give you, can give you guys more of a uh, more of the experience that I've had personally if companies actually do ask me for my GPA. Short answer is no. In all the companies that I've worked for over the past three years, no one has asked me for my GPA. However, that does not mean that your company who you are going to work for is going to ask you for your GPA or they're not going to ask you for your GPA. So it's kind of a risk. Is your company going to ask you? No one really knows until you fill out that application. Also, there's different reasons why you want to have a high GPA. And you might want to have a high GPA because you want to go to graduate school and you want that graduate school to lead you to a better industry job. If you're someone who wants to go work for themselves and have their own company, start their own business, then honestly your GPA does not matter at all. Because you're working for yourself, you're deciding your own salary, you're deciding your own hours, you're deciding how much you want to work and how much money you actually want to make. So in the end, if you're working for yourself, no, GPA does not matter at all. If you're someone who wants to go work for a big company like Google, Facebook, um, I don't know, you name it, all those big tech companies, Microsoft, all of those, then maybe your GPA does matter because you want they want to hire the best students that are out there. However, GPA really is not the only thing that recruiters are actually looking for, and that might surprise you. Recruiters are looking for someone who has a very strong application, both in school and out of school. So if you're someone who is just career focused, getting straight A's all the time, 4.0 GPA all throughout high school, all throughout college, but you're not doing any extracurricular activities like going to clubs, making projects, uh, showing that you are a normal human being and not just a school book focused person, well, then you're going to be having having some trouble. Depending on the company, they might really want you to be a book focused person. However, if you're not really a book focused person and you're someone who has a low 3.0 GPA or even lower, you're going to really want to apply yourself in other aspects. You're going to want to join those big clubs like the engineering clubs. You're going to want to start your do some projects, um, work on some extracurricular activities that can really boost your resume versus those, ki those kids who are just 4.0 students and have nothing else on there. If you're someone that wants to go to law school to get in your MBA, a master's program, PhD, then sure, your GPA is going to matter to get into those schools. They will 100% look at your application. They'll see every C that you get, every W you get in your transcript, Y grade, pat, like your pass fail, they will look at that and take into consideration if they want to accept you because they want to keep their program competitive. However, like I mentioned, if you're not someone who wants to go do a postgraduate work, then maybe your GPA is not as important as those people who really do want to go and do more school after their undergraduate degree. But if you do want to work for a big company, maybe your GPA will matter. I personally am working for Amazon this summer and they did not ask me for my GPA. So it really is just a hit or miss. I mean, I have a ton of extracurricular activities on my resume to show for that I'm also a human being outside of being a good student. So it really just depends on the company, depends on who you are as a person. And since you're wondering, we are studying engineering, which is a super hard focus of industry um, that you're studying. So. Many companies do not expect students to be graduating with those 4.0 and above GPAs because honestly, the stuff that we are learning is extremely tough, is extremely difficult. People know that and the industry leaders know that we're not out here doing a very easy major. We're out here really struggling, grinding in topics that most people cannot even get through. So not having the highest GPA is okay. Just make sure you're boosting that up with some extracurricular activities like I mentioned earlier. In the end, when you're asking yourself, does GPA really matter as an engineering student? You really just gotta ask yourself where you wanna work, what you wanna do if just getting your undergraduate degree is enough, and basically, am I going to be marketable 
basically that means like are you gonna have those extra activities besides a good GPA or besides a bad GPA that can get you that good job that you've always wanted so I think with those three questions you guys can ask yourselves where do I really want to be do I want to spend that time with my friends having more fun or do I want to be book focused and doing a couple little extra activities so if you guys can answer those three questions yourself then I think you guys are on the way to deciding if a good GPA actually really does matter if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Uh, drop a comment down below. I will be happy to answer it. And with that, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.